Hey guys, look here from 13 Motorsports. I'm going to be installing another really cool Ferris engineering product. Their brakes, there's part number there, Alpha 06 Ford Alpha for the GR86. So, what is the purpose of a brake master cylinder brace? So, it's, it's simply put, it's a brace under, which is this part here, um, to support it. Because as you press on the brake pedal, which is located uh, behind the booster here, the master cylinder actually deflects some before it produces enough hydraulic pressure to actuate the brakes. Or during, I suppose, is, is also accurate. So this brace, I'm assuming, is going to install somewhere between the strut tower and the master cylinder and then we're gonna crank on it to give it some preload to support this so that when you press on the brakes and this tries to move outward it'll support it and stop that un unwanted play giving you a firm uh, giving you a firmer brake pedal and also making you more confident in your brakes that you're not uh, dealing with that little bit of mush before the brakes actually start applying on the car so stay tuned okay so opening up the package here first time it's in there. Yeah, they always give you this little thing about their products, some stickers, and what looks to be the parts. I see a little felt pad here. This is the actual billet part that they make. Oh, that's really nice. It's quite an organic shape. All right, definitely done with some computational design. So it looks like fastener hole there, fastener hole there. I think the uh, one of the lines wrap through here, and then you're gonna install the stopper in there. So you can look up their instructions on their website. Um, I rarely follow instructions, so I'm just gonna put this together the way I think it goes and hope for the best. Okay, so we'll open up all these parts here. That's the stopper itself, which sits in that ball. Okay. There's some hardware here, not sure what that's for. I might actually look that up. And then let's see how this thing goes together. Okay. So this thing's pretty simple. Um, install the jam, jam nut and the actual master cylinder stopper. This round portion has a little detent for that. That's going to be pushing up against the master cylinder. This foam wraps around the AC line right here. So just install it and then mark off where it's going to touch and then we're going to wrap this adhesive backed foam around that so that it doesn't chafe. And then last but not least, so there's one screw in there you remove, which is already there. It's that one there. Unscrew that and that's going to go through this hole. The screw they supply you here, this 5 mil, goes through the counterboard hole. And then if you notice, there's a little threaded portion on this side. So you got to take your wheel off and reach in through the wheel well, and then you screw this little guy in there. So I'm going to go ahead and install everything and just go over it for you after. Okay, there's two stickers down here that cover those holes we need to use. So just take those off. This comes right off of your fingernail. This guy's a 5 mil. So what to do with this is put this in place and line it up with the holes. And then pay attention to which part of the AC line you gotta cover. And then we're going to cover it with this foam here. All right, so it looked like... Nice and snug. And then I'm going to slip this on again. All right, get that socket head cap screw into the counterboard hole. Screw that guy in. Kind of awkward, but 
definitely do it. Get the little this little sucker in there now. I'm gonna go get an adjustable wrench to tighten that. I'm not guessing what size it is. You know, my recommendation on installing this is just a very slight bit of preload. That's it. This little guy, it's four mil, goes in that hole right behind the spring there. It's going to be a little tricky to get to, so screw it in carefully. And then that's it. It's installed, it's preloaded, uh, Varus claims 65% uh, reduction in deflection, and... I believe him. It makes sense. Thanks for watching, guys.